today we are going to discuss about past year chapter 5 state of matter question 1 and question 2 is about gas PSPM 2011-2012 and PSPM 2012-2013 Question 1 Write the ideal gas equation for one mole of gas State two assumptions made in the ideal gas equation So for ideal gas equation is PV equal to nRT So one mole means when n equal to 1 So PV equal to RT so assumption actually there are four assumptions. The first one is volume of gas particle is negligible compared to the volume of gas. Two, the gas particle do not has intermolecular forces or the gas part the intermolecular forces of gas particle is negligible. Number three, collision among gas particle are elastic. The kinetic energies of the gas particle before and after is the same. There is no loss of kinetic energy. And then number four, the temperature of the gas is proportional to the average kinetic energy of the gas. Three, explain how assumptions in B2 are addressed for the real gas in terms of Van der Waal equation, where A and B are the Van der Waal constant. So, if based on this B3 question, right, just now we mentioned there are four assumptions. Ignore the assumption for number three and number four because according to the Van der Waals equation, we just consider for the volume and intermolecular forces. That's why for question part B, only two assumptions are acceptable if we want to continue answer question B3. So as division, you have to remember there are four assumptions uh, for the ideal gas equation. Explain how assumptions in B2 are addressed. So, we need to explain in terms of pressure and volume. In real gas, there is a small intermolecular forces or attractive force between gas particles. As a result, right, the pressure exerted by a real gas is smaller than expected from ideal gas, especially at low temperature. So, in real gas, interparticles interaction or intermolecular forces of real gas will reduce the gas pressure. Therefore, the factors is A over V squared in the Van der Waals equation is added to correct the P term, pressure term. Okay, while in volume, real gas is larger than ideal gas. In real gas, the volume of particles of gas particles are not negligible. It increased the volume of gas. Therefore, the factors is P in the Van der Waals equation is reduced from V term. Question 2. In the offshore based oil drilling operation, methane gas CH4 was found at the bottom of the sea at 480 degrees Celsius and pressure of 12.8 atm. So there are two questions. First, calculate the volume of the gas needed to be transferred with this condition, volume, pressure and temperature. Number two is determine the mass of the gas being transferred. So for A1, we need to apply a formula which combines from Boyce law and Charles law. But before that, you have to identify what is the C1, P1, and then the question needs us to find out V1, and the T2, P2, and V2. Make sure all the unit is correct. For example, temperature must in Kelvin, pressure in ATM, both of them are the same, and then volume in this case should is in liter. So substitute, and then you get the answer, 359 liter. Okay, for A2, find the mass. So first of all, we are going to apply the volume, ideal gas equation PV equal to nRT. And then we convert because N equal to mass over molar mass. And then you substitute the N mass over molar mass into N. Then you get this equation. And then you try to change until in the, in the term of mass. So mass equal to PV molar mass equal to over RT. Sorry, mass equal to PV MR over RT. Then substitute, you get the answer 118. 9.7 gram or hope you all learned something please do remember subscribe like and share this channel thank you